Good morning, folks. We've got a nice little breather on our star at the moment, but there are more sunspots coming. We've got a look at space chemistry, and we'll see a study that elucidates the enhanced risk from the sun during a geomagnetic excursion, like the one we're in now. The last 24 hours brought only minor flares. The plasma filaments remain stable, and solar wind is modestly intense, bringing KP up off the floor, but without geomagnetic storms. Despite the quieter last day on the sun, we do have several active regions, and as the plasma filaments are beginning to depart, we can see from the left more sunspots are coming into view in the coming days. Here's to hoping the 5.9 month cycle uptick will be ending soon, but we are at sunspot maximum. Enhanced activity will remain to some degree regardless. Now let's go out to Orion, and we're zooming in on the V883 protostar, a pre-stellar disk that is currently coming together and has caught the eye of astronomers with a profoundly extended snow line. The water and ice extend out to 80 AU, which is well over twice the distance from the Sun to Pluto. It confirms that the water exists long before the star does, which confirms that the water in our solar system was here long before our Sun was. Today's top story is meant to be about atmospheric erosion enhancement during powerful solar events and a weakening magnetic field of a planet. But in doing so, they find that the magnetopause standoff distance from the planet is reduced, squeezing the magnetic fields towards the planet on the sunlit side. This is one of the reasons that the solar storm impacts are greater during a magnetic pole shift, and it also explains how you get the thunderbolt of the gods, the arc discharge from the top of the sky, described by Robert Schock, described by Anthony Peratt putting science behind the ancient stories of a solar disaster as the L shells can take on too much energy while getting squeezed too closely to the planet and they discharge downward. This is coming during the ongoing magnetic shift of Earth. Just a reminder, our e-magazine is open for subscription. It will be covering the most important science news from the last month as a reminder of the updates, perspective, and relevance of the shows of the last several weeks. First month is discounted at the link below. We greatly appreciate your support. Again, it's the links to the e-magazine, the new store, our playlist, the websites, and much more found below. Subscribe, and we'll do this all again tomorrow, right here, but right now. It's 5.30 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.